Hello, welcome to Circulus. In this video, we are going to cover part two of the inquiry notes functionality. In the previous video titled Circulus Tutorial for Creating Inquiry Notes, we went over the importance of inquiry notes within the Circulus application and how to create a new inquiry note and assign it to a specific person. In this video, we will cover how to respond to inquiry notes that are assigned to you. I've went ahead and logged into Circulus and can see the dashboard here. Any inquiry notes that are assigned to you and require your response will be under the Assigned to Me section. As you can see, all of these documents have active inquiry notes that require my response. Let's go ahead and navigate to a document. You will notice that there is a number next to the inquiry note icon. This shows that there is one inquiry note assigned to me for this particular document. Because there is an inquiry requiring my response, the inquiry note screen will by default open to the requiring action section. You will notice that there is a one next to the requiring action tab as well, since there is only one question for me at this time. If there were any other active questions for this document that require your response, they would also be listed here. You will be able to view the entire conversation and reply back. Let's go ahead and respond to this inquiry. As you can see, everything is date and timestamped for your reference. Now, let's go back to the dashboard. You'll notice that the number under the assigned to me queue has reduced since we just responded to an inquiry. I want to draw your attention to the bell icon at the top right corner of the screen. You will notice this icon as you navigate through every page within Circulus. This is a flyout that allows you to quickly respond to your assigned inquiries while working on any screen of the platform. Circulus will not navigate you away from your current screen while you open the flyout, which makes it efficient to answer your inquiries while doing other tasks within the application. As you can see, there is a count by the icon to show how many inquiries you have awaiting your response. The count will remain the same until you reply to a note. When you open the flyout, you will see some of the recent inquiries listed. If you know what the question is referring to and you want to quickly respond, you can do so here. But if you need to know more before responding, you can use the icons on the left to view the image or go to the document details page. I hope you have a better understanding of how to respond to an inquiry assigned to you in the Circulus application. For more Circulus tips, tricks, and tutorials, make sure to check out our other videos. Thank you.